It's off the side of the rim by Marshall. India Banks driving to the paint, passes it up. And Miami is on the board, and Bondu with the bucket for the Canes. Bondu wide open, gives the dish, easy two points for Miami. And Bondu top three on the team, and points per game, rebounds per game, steals per game on the other end. Still holds the record this year, by the way, for most points scored by an ACC player. 36 points against Clemson. With the up and under, meanwhile, for Miami is Taylor Mason, the senior from Decatur, Georgia. Florida State working it around to Lassiter. And Lassiter's really good at catching and facing up right there and, and gets an easy two for her. Uh, keeping it alive, giving Florida State an extra possession. We'll see what they do with it. Bianca Jackson buries the jumper. Final seconds of the first. Taking away, we'll see how the Knolls finish it off. Lassiter fires one up and beats the buzzer. Take a four-point lead as we get ready to head to the second quarter. Sayani Lassiter, the junior. See how they respond in the second. And Bondu had a good look but passed it up. Well, they're, they're moving the ball. The ball's not getting stuck in their hands. And a great drive by Arabic. We're from Gulf Coast State, averaging eight points per contest. Couldn't get it to go. Long distance, Bianca Jackson. 19 points in her last game against North Carolina, trying to get going here against the Canes. Well, I, I love Bianca Jackson's game. She can drive to the basket. She can pull up and shoot the three. Charge back on the other end. It's Miami basketball. You get the rebound, you take it up the floor. Elsie Marshall driving it. Miami 5 for 19 from the field. The Knowles 5 for 18 going baseline. Jackson is running out of room. There is Weber from outside. The Knowles starting to get going from downtown now. The state is at a couple of threes over the last two minutes. Oh, and the turnover forced by Miami. Yeah, back the other way come the Canes and taking advantage. Well, you got to look inside. Uh, Myers is wide open. Turnover. Wow. This. That's what they do. This is Miami basketball. Get a steal and go. Tied at 17. Florida State wanting to run as well and did a great job of coming in, getting in the lane and kicking out to your three-point shooter. And down the, the, the rebound and, and slowing down a little bit, getting, going to get the high ball screen, and we'll see if they try to go inside to Roby. Driving into the paint, the foul is Taylor Mason. We'll be back from Coral Gables. Came with a chance to tie. Well, giving the younger players or the, or the players that haven't usually get a lot of playing time a chance to step up and prove they can play. Are outscoring Florida State 13-11 in this quarter. Still trail by two with less than two to play in the half. Shot clock at six. They got to hurry. Pull up jumper is good. Shot clock again under 10 for the Knowles. Jackson has it, clock at five, and a turnover forced. Back the other way comes Miami. They got a three on one. Harden gives it down low, and Mason drops it through. A lot of defense, a lot of up and down, physical game, and we'll see what transpires in this second half. Jones immediately lobs it down low. Denied. Knowles back the other way, three on three. Morgan Jones with the miss. And here come the Canes. Yeah, nothing doesn't seem to affect Miami. They just come, they get the ball, they just come on down the floor. She's in shock. I'm in shock. I, I thought for sure that that last one was going down, and she's going to continue to shoot until she scores. Great move to the bucket by Kelsey Marshall, the senior. While 27-26, thanks to the senior leader, who now is up to seven points. Canes back the other way. India Banks all alone. Looking at the referee, she wanted a foul. No whistle. That's a turnover. Another one for Florida State. Their 13th. Well, just making Florida State play fast, and when they play fast, they just get a little sloppy. And I'm sure Brooks trying to get her team fired up and stop turning the ball over. Nine nothing but, run to begin the second half for Miami, and that one comes to an end. What they need to do, Florida State. Marshall over to Mbondu. Find the Great. cutting Banks going baseline. Great teamwork, great passing, and Bondu to Banks. High quality shots right now. Shot clock at four. They got to hoist one up. Sammy Puisis with the pull up jumper beating the buzzer. 
Well, Puisa shows she can get a little shot fake. She doesn't have to just shoot the three, and they needed that Florida State. Oh, what a pretty scoop on the other end by India Banks. Love it. it looks like both teams are playing on roller skates. It's up and down the floor. It's a far cry from the first half, and Puisa answers back to a three-point game. Trouble, what did you make of them sending her back to the bench moments ago despite not picking up a foul? Well, just just wanted to settle down. She looked really frustrated, Alex, when she went off the floor. 89% in the first half. They are 7 for 7 from the field. And Bondu with 9 points leading the way. And going to the bucket, make it 8 for 8 for Miami. They've extended their lead out to 7. And you can see the body language there from Morgan Jones, obviously extremely frustrated. Well, Morgan Jones is not going to get too much more open than what she did. They're moving the ball around. And then what does Miami do? Come back. Boy, I think Florida State is getting open looks. They're just knocking, not knocking down shots. Yeah, this half, Florida State shooting just 29% pull-up jumper by Miami. Destiny Harden gets the roll. We would just have one three. I mean, that's a team that's averaging just about seven three-pointers per game. And coming up with the steal, the Miami defense taking it the other way. All alone, Jameer Houston. Just sprint down and and try to, to either block a shot or... or you got to take care of the basketball and, and Lindsey Myers, your, your team needs you right now. You need to get physical step up. Solid. That's that's getting it done on the offensive end. And on the defensive end, just a second ago, Banks comes up with a steal. Great pass from Mbondu to a cutting Taylor Mason. Just over nine minutes to go as the Hurricanes for two quarters were locked in an absolute battle with Florida State. Well, and they have the firepower. They have the offensive scoring power to get back in this basketball game. Just Florida State's got to amp up their defense and, and let their defense help their offense come along. Banks double team gets it off to Mbondu. Destiny Harden has a good look and buries the jumper. Mbondu Gosh. another board, her sixth. Miami is doing a great job of keeping Florida State <laughs> off the boards. But Taylor Mason. Well, she has the ability to coach and rep and officiate, too, so I love it. <laughs> she can do it all. Multitasking. She can do it all. On the other end, a huge bucket for Morgan Jones. That one nearly turned over. It's just Jones hard, trying to hard rip hurt. it away from Mason, and she does. The aggressive defense pays off. It's a one-on-two. She keeps it and drops it in. Avitz does a great job of running this basketball team. Knows when to run, knows when to pull it back out. Oh, great pass. Wow. Underneath, we said she said Kane's one for 14 from behind the arc, but still up by double digits. Jones swooping into the lane. 3.20 to go, 10-point game. Ariavets drive into the bucket. And again, another clear path for the Hurricane. Staying on people are not letting an open three anyone get a wide open three and then they're protecting the basket as well one of 13 from downtown but they got 42 points in the paint to more than make up for it driving into the lane and one as the hurricanes continue to get it done they compete when the opposing team is shooting 75 percent like miami is in the second half just been unreal offensively and bondu nice moves in the paint florida state in danger of setting a season low for points their previous season low, 56 against Louisville. Five shy of that, Jones going to the bucket. I'm really shocked that she got the 10, but good for her. Yeah, all of her field goals coming in the fourth quarter, and another bucket. I, I thought it would be a three-point shooting contest, but... Jones lobs one up, and there you go. That is career victory number 300 at Miami for Katie Meyer.